Big news from the Senate in just the last hour or so. The controversial transgender bill will not advance this session. Last week, the Idaho House voted to pass House Bill 675, which would make it illegal for anyone under the age of 18 in Idaho to get gender confirmation surgery. It would also put a ban on puberty blockers and hormone treatments, things like that that are used to assist in a gender, gender transition. Last week, we heard from Senate President Chuck Winder, who said he believed the odds were very low of the bill being brought up in the Senate. Now, well, we can confirm it. This afternoon, the Senate Majority Caucus issued this statement, and in it they say while they oppose any and all gender reassignment surgeries, they quote, House Bill 675 undermines parental rights and allows the government to interfere in parents' medical decisions, making authority for their children, decision-making authority for their children. We believe in parents' rights, and that's the best decisions regarding medical treatments that are options for their children. We believe they are made by the parents with the benefit of their physician's advice and expertise. So a lot of that saying, yeah, just let the parents figure it out on their own so they don't want to step in the middle of that, which is why the bill now literally and figuratively is in a drawer in the State Affairs Committee and will not see the light of day. They add they're currently aware no doctors offer this kind of surgery to minors in Idaho. We're still waiting to hear, by the way, what will happen with House Bill 66, 666, the senator called the mischief bill.